what sort of things do you think are absolutely signature to having a great theme party? You have to have a signature drink, number one. You need to have a good dip, and you need to have a simple and elegant dessert. Those three things, and you're set. You've got a party. So we're going to start That's off simple. by making this golden, delicious peach sparkler, which is one of my favorite things. And we're going to do something kind of fancy, because it's a theme party. We're going to dip it in a little water like you would a margarita, and put it in some beautifully colored sugar. Wow. Not salt, because <laughs> it's much better that way. Yeah, and a little bit of peach way. puree. And will you grab that bottle for me, sure. please? A little peach puree, and that's elderflower syrup. Elderflower syrup, We're how so much? We're so fancy, that's good, oh. a little bit. And then you can use either sparkling grape juice or sparkling apple cider or champagne, and you have a beautiful sparkling cocktail. Look how simple that is, and just yes. give it a stir. Yes, and now go ahead and try that. I'm so gonna try that. Please. This is your signature drink, everyone. <laughs> thank you, of course. Your perfect signature drink. <laughs> Cheers to you. Oh, thank you. That is delicious. Isn't that delicious? Okay, this is really good. Good. You love this. Now so we need now? to make a dip. Every party needs a good dip. I agree. Now I'm going to put you to work a little bit here. No, here you no go. No problem. You help me scrape some of this fresh sure. goat cheese right into this little container here that we're going to pop in the oven. Try and get that nice and flat, if you will. All or, right. So or whatever. Of... Why goat cheese? <laughs> Goat cheese is so good for you. It's really low in fat and calories, and it's really good for people who are lactose intolerant. They can have it too. Uh -huh. So you want to have things at your party that everybody can eat. I'm going to add some caramelized onions on top. You did a good job. Sort of getting there, You right? can come over before the party and help me. Okay, <laughs> we'll fine. I'll, prep I'll help you, Chefy. <laughs> All right, I like it. I'll definitely help you. And then I just took some simple orange marmalade and some sriracha and cooked it up on the stove top to make a beautiful glaze. So this is your spicy sweet mm. element. Pour that right on top. Will you All help right, me out with that sure. one? Sure. Thank you, ma'am. Beautiful. And oh my just kind of smooth it out. Yeah. Oh my gosh. You this is for me. Easy. <laughs> so, so and then you pop that in the oven. That's and it. And then you put yeah for about five to seven minutes. And then you put it under broil for about three to five till it's nice and caramelized and beautiful. I'm going to show you the end product, Ooh. everybody. See that bad boy? Beautiful. Look how simple that is. Simple and delicious. And. I know you get mad at me because I don't let you taste things, so you're going to have to wait because we're going to make the sweet potato chips from scratch. You know it's taking everything in me now. I know it is. She's using right. so much self-control right now. <laughs> so I just have a simple mandolin here to slice the sweet potato. Have you ever done this? I've never done this. All right, I'm going to show you real quickly. You just go over like this, hold it nice and firm, mm -hmm. and just slice your sweet potato, and you'll see. You've got little sweet potatoes. You want to try? I'm so excited. Try yes, it. I would love to try this. We'll put this. them down here, and then you just use a little bit of oil and brush them on those sweet potatoes. Look at you. Get my mandolin on, Chef Fancy, Chef fancy. <laughs> and then we throw this in the oven, and we have homemade baked sweet potato chips to try our dip with. Seems pretty simple, right? It's doable. All for you, Queen Latifah. Why don't you try that? Now? Please. Now I, I can get hold to you try. back. Thank you very much. And the nice thing about dip is it gets everybody around the table, mm -hmm. and they get really into it, and it's a shared experience. Oh, man. Look at that. <laughs> I got a big old scoop. I know you did. Oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> A little vegetable. Sweet potatoes are really good for your skin, you I'm guys. I'm stuck on the sweet bad. potatoes. They're delicious, aren't they? Those are great. And then we have another. Oh, you got to get that dip. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Do it. Mm. Yes. Mm. All right. Next, we got to try our simple dessert here. I'm just going to go on. She can keep snacking. I'm going to keep dipping. I just have some melted white chocolate here. And you add these to some cute, like some little straw, sorry, strawberries, cherries, whatever fruit you have in the fridge. Strawberries work beautifully. So good. And you put some fun little sprinklers right on top. I and you love have this them. idea. Little Jimmy sprinkles, whatever you want to use. Drages. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then over here. I mean, look what you just did. It looks you like a it, decoration, but it's an you, edible it's decoration. Special. And it's right? special. Yes, it is. Absolutely. You can do one. I'm not too. Perfect. Almost See? not nearly as cute as yours, but I, I can work on it. Room You're for good. improvement. Well, we couldn't just let you guys survive on that little food. We just have some shrimp rolls and some beautiful edible salad that you can have. It's fantastic. I'm looking forward to this party. I may be at some of the award shows, but if, oh, if, if I have a slim chance I'm not there, I may have to come you can hang come out over. with you, Chef. I'll help as long as I get to eat. <laughs> okay. You know come, me. Come <laughs> slum it with us. We'll feed you well. I sure will. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here Thank again. You Thank you for having me. Thank you for showing me. us how to do award season theme parties right